Looking sharp back in that studio. Thank you for that. And now we're ready to get the third quarter underway as these teams take the field. The Broncos setting up here for the kickoff. The second half is officially underway. Flacco will lead his offense back onto the field here as this goes for a touchback. The Ravens take the field here in the second half, looking to extend their lead in this one, partner. Yeah, you know what you do? It's halftime is over. You come out here. You're not sure what the new game plan is going to be, but feel your way into the game. Don't take a chance early and turn the football over. It's a two tight end formation. Second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. Crockett Gilmore has the catch. Keep the momentum on your side. You got a lead here in the second half. Nice play that time. You pick up the first down. Let's see if you can take advantage of it. Flacco's completion percentage, 70% on the day. First down at the 46. Stands in the pocket. Ravens in the end zone. Smith's second touchdown of the game. Now we're talking about some of the fastest humans on earth. And we take into account you can't touch them or breathe on them. That's how they're able to get open and make so many catches. Ravens getting set for the extra point. Add the extra point. The kick is good. Smith's going to watch now as his defense gets ready to come into the game. He just put up over 50 yards receiving, helping his team go down the field for the score. The Broncos back deep, ready to receive. Bolden's going to start his return. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. center first down at the 23 Anderson's gonna take the handoff now and it sucks there to meet him if you want to run the football with success you're gonna have plays like this where they pick up very little yardage don't listen to the fans keep running it and it'll work that last running play was good for only a yard so it's second down and nine the Broncos lined up. Bunch formation. Reaches out and grabs it. Third catch today so far. The Broncos just picked up a big first down that time, Jim. When you're down in the second half, every first down is crucial. Nice job that time by the offense. Manning's completion percentage, 60% on the day. At the 34, 66 yards from pay dirt. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Anderson's got it on the handle. He'll pick up seven this time. Well, you can't knock them all down, and sometimes the running back has just got to break a tackle. Good job that time.
Second and three after that last carry. Anderson's lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. Takes it again. Keeps his legs moving. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. He's now got 70-plus yards on the ground. Big first down by the offense that time. Here in the second half, they're losing a close game. When you get that first down, it just gives you confidence. It opens up the playbook, and it just gives you a better chance of going down the field and getting the score. The Ravens defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. First down at the 46. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Loss of five on the play. Second and long. Andre Caldwell has the catch. In this league now, you have so many talented receivers who can go down the field and make tough catches that you can design a play that might give you a chance to pick up this first down, even though it's long. Third down after the catch. Manning standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. Throw it to the outside, and they've got the hookup. The Broncos, good job that time, moving the chains, picking up that first down. And Jim, of course, there's no time to panic in a situation like this. I think they know that. It's in the second half. You've got your, you're down just a few points. Just keep looking for ways to get another first down, and that'll serve your team well. The Ravens defense now is going to go nickel. Now first and ten. Arrington's all over that offense and brings him down. Advancing it now inside the 40. Manning's back in shotgun formation. Has his man. That's his fifth catch of the day. The Broncos did a good job that time picking up the first down. Let's look at the situation. You're behind the second half. You keep looking to pick up those first downs, and you know you get enough of them. What does it do? Pretty simple. It leads to a score. Manning's now completed four in a row. Anytime your team is down, you're inside the other team's red zone, you look for one of your star players, your quarterback, wide receiver, or running back. They need to make a big play here. And off out of the eye. And that'll close the gap. And with more than a quarter to play, this situation here is suddenly looking a whole lot less dire. How about that? Just in a few seconds, everything turns around. Now we have a close game, and everything is going to change here late in the third going into the fourth. two-point conversion on that occasion. Yeah, good job by the offense. They executed the play perfectly, and they got in the end zone, like you said. He got that two points. <laughs> the 
The Ravens return team is ready. Jackson's going to take a knee, so this will come out to the 20. The Ravens head back onto the field with their offense. We're going to see if they can keep the scoring onslaught going as we've seen touchdowns on consecutive possessions here, Phil. Jim, these teams are so hot. And when you're hot like this on the offensive side, you just look at the coach and say, keep sending them in because we're going to make it work. Double tight end formation. Pitta can't bring it in. That'll probably go as a drop. Got to give the secondary credit. In this passing league now, it's hard to make plays, but a good play there and another incomplete pass. Second down and 10. Heaving it down the field. Third long situations. A lot of coordinators in this league will run a draw play on third long. Why? Because they're just looking for field position, pick up a few yards, and then by some miracle, if the running back's able to make guys miss, break some tackles, and pick up a first down, man, that's just gravy. Following that incompletion, it sets up third and 10. The Ravens get set at the line, needing to get to the 30 for a first. And this will be incomplete. It'll be a three and out. The Ravens don't have a lot of options on third and long situations. The pass goes incomplete, and the defense did a good job of staying back there and not giving up the deep throw. Sam Cook for the punt. Sanders has got it at the 25. Gains 13. Since going back out there, I'm sure with the goal of continuing to do what he's been doing these first three quarters, and that's punching big holes through that defense. Oh, man, he's got the size to make it happen. It doesn't matter if you don't even block him sometimes. He'll just run you over. He's a lot of fun to watch. One more snap, and another quarter is in the books. First down at the 37. After a short delay, now go we'll run it. This game is coming down to the wire as we head to the fourth. Which defense will flinch first? We're back after this.